All right, gents. So Dr. Squash just came out with the Game of Thrones collection. So this Game of Thrones collection is a collaboration between HBO and Dr. Squash. This is a limited edition collection and it includes three bar soaps. Viserion's Freeze, Thousand Sword Scrub, and Dragon's Blaze. Now you can get three bar soaps for $24 or you can get it as a box set for $29. Now the box is nice because it has the Game of Thrones logo on the front of it and it also has a map included as well. Also has some of the names. I didn't check how accurate this map was, but if you guys know if this map is accurate, let us know in the comment section below. On the inside, there's a picture of two dragons that are featured on two of the bar soaps, and then you have the three bar soaps. Now, first thing you notice when you open this box is the fragrance. So let's look at each bar soap. Thousand Sword Scrub is a medium grit bar soap. And the featured ingredients include iron bark and volcanic sand, which serves as a mild exfoliant. Now on the box it says it smells like the ruler of Westeros, but the notes include cedar, citrus, and bergamot. And I would say this bar soap does have a citrus fragrance to it, but it's a hint of a sweetness to it, which is probably the cedar that is included. I really like the fragrance of the bar soap. It smells really, really good. Does it remind me of another bar soap? Maybe hints of it does, but overall, I can't really say that this bar soap smells like other Dr. Squash bar soaps. It smells like itself. Fursarian's Freeze is a zero grip bar soap, and a featured ingredient is menthol crystals. First of all, I like the design of this bar soap because not only do they have the dragon on it, but they have the face of a White Walker. When I used to watch Game of Thrones, White Walkers were always scary looking. They seemed very powerful. It kind of brought more drama to the show. There were characters that I really enjoyed in the show. So just for that fact, I like the design of this box of this bar soap. Now, I remember Dr. Squash using menthol crystals in another bar soap. I didn't really notice a difference with the menthol crystals. I don't remember getting a cooling sensation from it at all. Now they say this bar soap has an icy mint fragrance to it with the notes of mint and pine combined together. I feel like that is pretty much exactly how this bar soap smells. To me, I think it has a nice clean fragrance to it. It smells really good, but it's very light in my opinion. I don't know if it's because I've been smelling all three of these bar soaps um, since I started recording the video. <laughs> to me, it seems pretty light. Dragon's Blaze is a heavy grit bar soap and it features pumice and amber. Now they say this bar soap smells like the living, <laughs> but the notes of this bar soap includes cinnamon, red peppercorn, and amber. Now being that it has cinnamon in it, you would expect it to be a spicy bar. I would say that it's still spicy, but it's more on the sweet side. I would say that that's the amber playing a part in it. But as you guys know, I'm not a huge fan of heavy grip bar soap, but having a heavy grip bar soap can benefit you because it's a good way to get rid of all the dead skin cells. But just remember that when you use this, just use it at least one or two times a week. So just keep that in mind. So if I had to rank these three, Dragon's Blaze will be number one. After smelling it through the box, it was number three at first. But once I used it, it immediately went up to number one. And when I first used it, I didn't feel any exfoliation, which is what you normally get with most of Dr. Squash's medium and heavy grip bar soaps. But as you continue to use it, it gets very aggressive. So just keep that in mind. It is very heavy. Two is Thousand Sword Scrub. Smelling this from the box, it smelled good. And I put this at number two, but after using it, it stayed steady at number two. When I first used it, it was very smooth. After a few scrubs, you could feel the grit and it was medium. Farsarian's Freeze would be number three because the fragrance isn't that strong. If it was stronger, I would put it at number two. But because the scent is so mild and so light, I will put it at three. But it smells really good and it has zero grit, which is one of my favorite types of bars. It's still a good bar soap, but if it was stronger, I would put it at number two. When I think about this collection, I like the design of it. I did watch the Game of Thrones and there's so many directions that they could have went. They could have went with the characters, the different houses, which 
I would kind of say this collection has done, but I think it's a good thing that they kept it the way that they did with this, because if they wanted to expand on it, they could always jump into the different characters. Great collection. If you're a Dr. Squash fan, I would recommend you pick this up. But if you're new to Dr. Squash, this is also a good collection to get, but I will also consider getting some of their more regular bar soaps as well, because those bar soaps are always around. So let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Always remember to be a gentleman, stay dapper, and I'll see you guys next video.